Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today, episode 21 of WWE 2K23, The Lock. Into the final part of the story. We're now looking for people to join our faction. Um, not quite sure how it's all going to work and pan out. I know Matt Riddle is someone we can uh, go and have a chat with, so we might go and have a look at him. Although, um, first thing I'm definitely going to do is go to check, mm -hmm. check the DMs and the social media, see what's to be done now. So once this decides to load up, we will get cracking. Here we go. So you've got Tavish, you've got Riddle, you've also got Xavier there. So, <clears throat> as you look on the Allies, we've got lots of people we can unlock here. Few legends with a few that we can't get to here and funnily enough how interesting this uh it's got a picture of my female character uh over <laughs> over where my male character should be it's a lovely little glitch there throwback thursday to that time i beat finn bala Great connecting with you again. It's been a while. So there's a few there we can check out. So let's let's go for the rock. Just because. <laughs> the rock being the rock wants to be the pick off the clown <laughs> it's a deal hopefully a few of these sort of recruiting processes won't take too long Good luck cracking this code. It's the former lock. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Gray's England. Weighing in at 215 pounds. Brandon. Matches like these with... Here comes the Clown Prince of WWE. And his opponent from Parts Unknown. Weighing in at 245 pounds, Doink the Clown. I mean, I, I usually love clowns, but Doink the Clown completely changed my opinion. Doink has struck fear into the hearts of the WWE Universe for many, many sleepless nights. I think Doink's pretty twisted. He likes to make kids cry. What kind of clown likes to make Evil kids Doink. cry? Well, if it makes you feel any better, Saxton, Doink also enjoys making adults cry and weep at the suffering he is about to inflict on his opponent. Evil Doink, best portrayed by It's Matt been a winding Ball. road for the WWE superstar known as The Lock, and his journey takes another unexpected twist Take here Take down Doink to humor the rock. The clown. I'd call that the understatement of the century, Cole. Is this really happening? And the better question, why? I heard rumblings backstage that none other than The Rock may have from the heavens. Oh, and he doesn't connect. Uh-oh. And a suplex. He saw it coming, taking advantage. Oh, oh. into a power bomb. 
Now that's what you call impact. A running Hurricane Rana. It's incredible, the inventiveness we are seeing on display here. Watch this athleticism. Oh, bro. Oh. Off the rope. Oh, I just completely oh. off target there. <laughs> now that was a harebrained idea to try that. Was... Maybe that will shut him up. And it's oh. reverse pain for that mistake. Goes head over heels. Something's about to go either very wrong or very rough. Flying. Diving what what the hell got away with that? He's lost some of his win now. Have another Spanish fly for you. Double. Standing Spanish fly, are you kidding me? Incredible. Oh, Swanton. He's stalking his opponent from the top turnbuckle. From the top. Elbow drop. Good Lord. The reverse of winning it, yeah. With the wherewithal to counter. Pump handle slam. That should be it. High risk territory for Doink. Launching. Coming back into the ring. Back to the action. That is what happens that when you throw your body around. You eventually meet the pavement. Suicide dive. Ooh. Well placed kick. Hey, that clown. Letting his opponent know he can take on the world right now. Sight set on the top rope. From the heavens all the way to the outside. Showing absolutely no apprehension to putting one's body on the line. Getting back into the ring. Like we're gonna see it. It worked out right. Will that keep Doink grounded? He it's does. All in a nice work. Here is your winner, Brenda. What an emphatic victory, guys. No contest. Hopefully, we'll assume at the rock now. What a steamrolling. Feel as though the rock's gonna be a part of a faction. It might as well be mine. It's just gonna be nice and quick now, that's the thing. Well, this loading screen certainly not being quick, that's for certain. Nice, that was done nice and quickly. So, if we go here and we go to our allies, the rock is there. Right, I did speak about they're in him, so let's go ahead. Hey, bro. know you're looking for help, but I'm going to cut to the chase. You're kind of uptight, and I've already been through that with Randy. No way, bro. Me? Uptight? I'm super cool. So relaxed. We could definitely hang. <clears throat> bro? <laughs> okay, bro. Then show me you can let loose by riding a scooter out to your next match while copying my entrance. Do that, then I'll know you can hang. <laughs> Whatever the next? Deal. I just need to borrow your scooter. You don't already have one? I'm having second thoughts. <laughs> Mine's in the, uh, shop. The scooter repair shop, which is definitely... A real thing. Oh, okay, bro. You can totally bogart mine. Look forward to seeing your goofy side. <laughs> Whatever next. If things are happening, sort of, and they're only sort of taking five, ten minutes to hit, we, we can slog out a few of these. 
A cool persona and a respected mixed martial arts background. Riddle is here to fight. Wait, that's not Riddle. What the heck is going on here? I don't know, but he's acting like Riddle, Scooter and all. I have no idea why he or anyone for that matter would want to do this. He's actually pretty good on that scooter. Maybe he's been practicing. Is this really the time for goofing off like this? He's got a deadline approaching where he needs to win the championship or he's gone from WWE forever. I think I'd be more focused on that. Well, maybe there's more to this we don't know about. Or maybe the stress of the deadline has caused him to lose it. Who knows? You're going to do the over the ropes and the feet? The flip -flop. certainly got Riddle's mannerisms down, yep. Pat. Again, I hate to be the downer, but that's not going to help him win this match, let alone overcome the difficult odds he faces trying to gain Slade's championship before SummerSlam. I just don't get it. I guess that wasn't an easy thing for the system to do with uh, having Looking to do it that way. Of this competitor tonight, my he only understands the significance of this match. This is an opportunity to make big headway on the roster. Hope he isn't getting paid by the hour because Vera Mahan is probably looking to make this a quick one. The Lion of WWE has feasted on many an opponent in his young career, clearly staking his claim as a big man. From the heavens, big time splash. Oh, Swanton. Head over heels. Yeah, incredible flip. And Veer's having trouble managing this onslaught. Can Mahan recover from this? Uh-oh. Way too oh, much. Oh, diving moonsault. And the lion looked more like a house cat there, guys. Yeah, but he's not breathing heavy yet. Tilt-a-whirl head scissors. From the heavens, catches nothing but air. Ooh, merciless looking blow. Oh, did you hear that? Implanted by the DDT. Looks like Veer's coming to accept the appreciation of the crowd right about now. Oh, down by the DDT. Wow, well, he turned this round quick. Well, grabbing the arms and just rapid stops. The stomp in every single part of his body. Big knee to the midsection. Trying to reverse and anything. Taking control. This is what it feels like to run into a competitor like Mahan. Oh, and a reversal. I'll tell you that, and then we do that. Focus. for that one. Horse forearm draped across the middle rope. And down. Ooh. Oh, you can tell he's feeling it now. This fight is pumping him up. How many do you and you get me old throat? Looking wobbly in the corner. This match has been incredible. And this now is what? Gonna be spectacular. Bulldog! Now he's got a chance to best Mahan here. Nice. Oh, Veer counters. It only gets a one count. No time to waste being shocked. You've got to maintain pressure. Tossed. She get airline miles for that. Oh, what a DDT! Wow. Climbing up top, he's got big plans. From the heavens, you gotta be kidding me! And that was a collision you don't want to be on the receiving end of. Came down like a wrecking ball on a cinder block. He's begging him to get up so he can put him back down. All right, back to it, returning to the ring. We'll try and hit a Spanish fly and try and end it there, but... Oh, 
Oh, wow. Scouted. Boom. Nice calf kick. Great elevation. This is it. Is it enough to put him away? No. Somehow kicked out. Holy moly. How? Holy moly. Incredible. Two kick outs. Wow. He just won't give up. This is what you call high risk, high reward. Uh oh. Wait. Uh -oh. Oh, it kind of works. The body is starting to fail at this. Oh, looks like we're going to see it. Second time, lucky. And Mahan is laid out. And then we've got it. Put it, guys. That was kind of a butt kicking. As always, Cole, you're more polite than I am, so I'll just say what we're all thinking. This was as one sided as it gets. So it looks like two we've recruited, I reckon. Xavier, let's upgrade while we are here. Let's upgrade submission just because it rounds us out a little bit better when it comes to social media. Finn Balor, wow, look at all of these. Nakamura, Goldberg. Oh, there's lots of options. Let's go with Owens just because we can. So we're going to try and make amends with Sammy to try and get KO on our side. Interesting this will be. He's dominated the world and now he's set his sights on WWE. The following contest is it? It's Mr. Money in the Bank. And his partner from Montreal, Quebec, Canada, weighing in at 212 pounds, Sammy Zayn. And here comes the underdog from the underground. If it was up to me, Sammy Zayn would stay in the underground. A man who always gets a strong reaction from the WWE Universe, and it will only intensify. Mr. Money in the Bank, eh? Gentlemen, 
class is in session. That's right, Cole. Show a little respect for Master Gable and the number one guy, Otis. And at a combined weight of 532 pounds, Chad Gable and Otis, the Alpha Academy. I didn't quite know who was going to turn up for this one. We accomplished in amateur wrestling together have won the Raw Tag Team titles. The dictionary definition of a rising tide raising all ships. Well, I never thought I'd say this, but the former Locke has teamed up with his WWE nemesis, Sami Zayn, to take on Alpha Academy here on Raw. The newly returned superstar is clearly doing whatever it takes to get back to the incredible heights he experienced in his WWE debut, ironically enough, against Sammy. Desperate times call for desperate measures, Saxton, and do you hear that? It's the sound of Shawn Michaels' 58-day clock ticking down by the second. And a kick! The adrenaline is pumping, and the WWE Universe is on his side. What a German suplex. Oh, Swanton. Chad Gable not looking himself right now. Right now, he's thinking one of two things, Cole. I'm from the heavens. Splash from the top. Mm, looking for a high-risk, high-reward situation. Uh-oh. Way too oh, oh, misses oh. the mark. Ooh, sharp kick. Able to get the advantage here. Oh my God, a DDT! Spike them. Can Gable withstand much more of this? You got him on the top. Oh, an elbow drop. Oh, it's a piercing elbow. Standing shooting star press, incredible. Don't tag. Don't He's tag. Out. Oh, the headbutt. He's able to sidestep there. Oh, that's how you establish dominance. Come, big fella, in you get. Wow, I can't even grapple with him by little thing. He's turning the tables. Headbutt to the back of the neck. What a chance. He's looking a little off balance. With the tag is Chad Gable. I'm reasonably happy with that tag. Ooh -hoo. Getting him into the corner. And Gable had it scouted. Wow, these boys are right on me. That puts a stop to Gable. Oh, Brendan, what have you done? Tilt the world. Tilt the world. Right. Boot to the gut will stop. Oh, looks like we're gonna see it. Selena Del Sol. Terrible position for Gable. Will it be? Yeah, it was enough. The victory as his opponent does his best. Saxton stares up at the lights. It was enough to get the win. That should be enough to get KO on side. Yeah, we're doing all right here. We're flying through them.
Okay. Maybe both in a different stuff in that match. <laughs> Dolph Ziggler is looking to make an impact tonight on Raw as he goes one-on-one -on -one with the Celtic Warriors, Sheamus. From behind, Dolph might not make it to his match tonight. What the hell is this all about? Some commotion in the backstage area. This is not going to be pretty. Nothing but close and unforgiving quarters back there. This is a huge recipe for disaster. Nice calf kick. Great elevation. Leaping into the wheelbarrow, up and around. Boom, DDT. You gonna pick anything up or? Oh, Take that's better work out that way. Oh, helicopter spin. This is ridiculous. This is insulting. This is entertaining. Guys, come on. Someone could seriously get hurt back there. Pretty sure that's the point, Saxton. They didn't go back there to do any loading, just some unloading of vicious offense. It's deep, and I don't think it's playable. And as off-limits as this area may be, they are clearly making themselves at home here. I don't know what it's like at your home, Cole, but they're definitely acting like they own the place. DDT! Inverted power slam! That's gonna hurt. Taking this fight onto that equipment pile. A lot of that equipment looks like it'll hurt. Kendo stick to the skull! Wow, how does that work out? What a tank down the... Oh, there it is. The captain's oh, hello there. locked in. This won't win the match. In trouble here. Ah, uh, chin lock back to his feet now. And elbow going to create some separation. Running Hurricane Rana. Fantastic. Standing on production boxes and shipping crates, willing to fight anywhere and everywhere. Ooh. He was waiting for him to make his move. Whatever you can do, I can do better. Counters on top of counters. Standing Spanish fly, are you kidding me? Incredible. Wow, we got him quick, but I got lucky oh, there. Gosh, that hurt. This doesn't look stable enough to be fighting on. And one more reversal. Talk about it evenly matched here. <coughs> Inverted crush. Oh! And we are looking at some true close quarters combat here on this dock. Nowhere to run, nowhere to hide. Just like that, Dolph dodges away. Evades the attack. He and you know what's next, guys? Stunner! Stunner! The list of superstars who have taken a tumble off that dock is long and illustrious. None of these competitors want to be added to it. What impact! Right in the kisser. Oh! Ooh. Clearly waiting for that. Extremely dangerous situation here. This loading dock is full of metal edges and hard surfaces. One false move and you could easily get injured bad. With the counter. Nice. He's got him scouted. Oh. Neck breaker. Oh. He knows how to avoid contact. I can work, did it? Nice calf kick, great elevation. Oof! Effective drop kick to the face. He's climbing up that long ladder. Where is he going? Let's take it a little bit early. I'm not sure if he's trying to escape or take this fight into a new and dangerous direction. Well, he did all his work getting up there. I hope he has a plan. Dolph Ziggler looking for the submission hold. The sleeper is applied and the body lock applied as well. Well, this isn't... Sleeper hold is cinched in. Oh, my goodness. Not for long. 
Oh. Calf kick right on point. These platforms are strictly meant for loading and maintenance. You need professional clearance to be up there. No, I don't think they care about any clearance. When there's this much animosity, you'll take every opportunity to punch your enemy in the face, no matter what the location. Ridiculous standing shooting star. And we know the backstory coming in. We knew this was going to be unpredictable. But he wants it one more time. Please we got stay it. down. Looks like you get your wish, Saxton. This brawl is over. We know Ziggler, <clears throat> that should be enough to tap up Goldberg. So I'm sat there thinking that we're only going to be able to get one sort of part of the story done every every episode and we've just slapped out four now which is really very very good so we've got another upgrade we're going to upgrade our defense on this occasion and if we go to story progress we've completed five and a 21 so there's a still a lot to do here as you can well see So we still got Bella. Oh, look out. Bella Nakamura. Rey Mysterio. There is so many to do here. So we've unlocked a fair few. I think you unlock the more you go through it, which is is wicked i'm quite happy where we're at at the moment so that's going to be the end of today's episode just terry and xavier wood so please give us a like please subscribe please turn the bells on if you want to be notified when a video goes live and we'll see you in a few days for another legacy video have a good one take care of yourselves